Hey y'all, it's your girl KB here, back with another Fortnite video. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how we're going to craft our items or weapons in Fortnite Season 6. So we have the regular ARs, uh, shotguns, submachines, and we have the crossbows. So I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade, aka craft, all of these weapons. So what I like to do is I start out in an area where there's a lot of, where I can get a lot of material. So I went out to Camp Kai. I'm gonna show you two other locations where you can go to get these mechanical parts. But we're gonna start here in Camp Kai and I'm gonna speed it up. So from each of these like vehicles and you know broken down smash vehicles, you can get mechanical parts. And with those mechanical parts is what you're gonna to use to upgrade your weapons. So you need about four mechanical parts per weapon and then it's gonna upgrade it to the next rarity. So right now I'm just showing you guys where you can find all these mechanical parts. And this is going to be for your makeshift weapons because we have primal weapons and we have makeshift. But you need mechanical parts for the makeshift weapons and you're going to need animal bones for the primal weapons. So as you can see, when you upgrade your uh, makeshift weapons, it's going to put it back to those OG weapons that we're used to, like the pump the scar and um i really like that at first i thought they had completely removed them from the game but there's an option for that and i love the fact that we can upgrade from my inventory all we need is those parts we don't have to go look for an upgrade bench we don't have to go find a character we can strictly just upgrade from our inventory okay guys so as you can see i'm up in a tree and i'm over here about to craft my weapons I can only craft the regular AR because I only have the mechanical parts. I could switch it to like a primal, but I would need animal bones to do so. So I'm going to show you guys that in just a minute. But before I do that, I also want to point out that when you upgrade, make sure you get the best rarity that you want because it appears that we can only upgrade one time, even if we have enough material to upgrade that weapon more than once. I'm noticing that I'm only able to upgrade it one time to the next rarity. So if you if you have a gray, hold out until you get like a green or a blue so you can upgrade to the best rarity possible. And then now I'm gonna show you a location that I like to go to. And I typically go to this on Rumble to complete the challenges faster. But I go over to this guy and this is the quickest way for me to find animal bones. I have yet to find a location where I can just see all the animal bones in one spot. So I buy 10 from him and that allows me to upgrade at least two primal weapons. So as you can see, I have the primal SMG and the primal AR. And for those, you just need four bones a piece. And then all you have to do is just hit the craft button and then you upgrade that weapon to the next rarity. This is so awesome, guys, though, because even if you have a primal weapon, you can still craft it to make it the OG weapon. All you need is those mechanical parts. So it's up to you whether you want to keep it the primal or keep it mechanical. But you have the option between two different weapons. It's kind of like the um, how it was in the past seasons where we could, what is it called? Cross upgrade where we had the heavy AR and then we had the regular scar. I, I just love the fact that we can do this in our inventory. All right, so, so next, I'm going to show you guys um, another location where I get my mechanical parts from. And that's going to be at Weeping Woods. I just turn on these RVs, and they all drop mechanical parts. And that's another way to upgrade. Like I said, you only need four parts per weapon. So you can easily get two weapons upgraded out of just destroying the RVs over here. Another area I like to go to to get the mechanical parts is also the junkyard that's outside of Dirty Docks. So we have Camp Cod, we have Weeping Woods, and then we have this junkyard outside of Dirty Docks. So these are the three areas that I like to go to to get my mechanical parts. And then, I, like I said, I like to go to that guy to get my 10 animal parts. 
but that's just me if you guys know of any other locations let me know and next i'm going to show you guys how we're going to upgrade our mechanical bow there are i believe at least at least six ways you can upgrade this bow the first way is by making it a, a explosive bow or you can make it a shock wave bow and you simply just need two shock waves to make it a shock wave bow and then you're going to need six grenades to make it that explosive bow so i'm going to show you what the shock wave bow looks like and then i'm going to also show you what the explosive uh crossbow looks like so this is a shock wave you just simply aim it at the person and it's going to blow them away like the shock wave does you see that and then now i found my other grenade and i'm going to show you what it looks like when you use the explosive bow. So I'm gonna aim into this window and you're gonna see like a bunch of explosives go off. So if somebody's just sitting in that window, that would have completely just destroyed their whole build. All right, next, I'm over here at Lazy Lake and I see that we now have, we have a flame bow, a stink bow, and to get the stink bow, you're going to need a fish. To get the um, flame bow, you're going to need a gas can or like the fireflies to build these bows. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. If you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for your girl. Leave me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, I always read my comment section. So let me know down below. Thank you guys so much. And you all have a great day and have fun in season six of Fortnite. Bye-bye.